Take it from me, even the foulest food will taste halfway decent if you eat it somewhere. So I will say this. <laughs> Would you care to share a performance with me? Mellifluous melodies are all the more pleasing when played on the piano. Thank you for sharing such joy with the world. I hope you will enchant us with even more splendid performances in time. <laughs> what are you looking at? If you got something to say, then spit it out. Just know that I'm such a badass that even Beck and his bitches couldn't handle me. Kick me out of their stupid little gang. That's right. You're standing face to face with the legendary Biff. You shaking in your boots yet? Oh. Uh, tough guy, huh? Respect. But it seems to me like we got no choice but to settle this with a game of Queen's Blood. And if I whoop your ass, you gotta give me three, no, seven whole gill. Secret. Truth is, I bailed from the bandit life because I just couldn't hack it. So I, I figured I'd turn over a new leaf and become a Queen's Blood player instead, but turns out I'm no good at that neither. You gotta tell me, what's the trick, man? How do I get your kind of skills? What, don't like handing out free advice or something? Only a real cheapskate would charge for that shit, asshole. Well, better hang on to that gill of yours, cause next time we meet, I'm gonna take seven off you for sure. Woo! So, how's the invest? What are you? Kind of Just like you said. Hell yeah! That's what I like to see. you're here in any case. I got a situation. See for yourself. We have one of your robed men. If you want him back, it will cost you one million gil. Agree to the terms, and we'll take care of the rest. What's this? Beats the hell out of me. Guess some fool got in her head I was making money off my research. 
You gonna pay up? Look at this place. We can barely afford bandages, never mind our ransom. <sighs> Only option is to save the man myself. Or hire the right merc to save him for me. Or the right merc's friend, to be more precise. Who better to hunt down a criminal than someone who's got a nose for tracking? One finer than any human could ever possess. Well, I can't argue with you there. That was easy. So where do we start? What you see is what you get. No hidden codes, ciphers, nothing. But hey, you're the detective. Well, I'm glad one of us is enjoying this. Cloud, the letter, if you don't mind. <laughs> There's a strong scent, but... Cologne, perhaps? How about that? Picked up the trail already. Ah, which reminds me. There's a compound in our rogue friend's sweat that glows when exposed to this light. Just hope it helps some. Follow me, Cloud. You can actually smell them? My olfactory sense is 7,000 times more sensitive than yours. Bodily secretions are as distinct as any perfume. A single sniff of a person's clothing is enough for me to locate them. Though there are a number of competing smells through which I must sift. Huh. What do I smell like? Hmm. Like a man who's killed his fair share of fiends, I suppose. <laughs> like blood and shit, then. Not literal shit, no. Wouldn't recommend... Their sense seems to lead straight ahead, but... Oh, that's not good. What? Nothing. Let's continue. Oh. Hello there. Different scent. He has nothing to do with the kidnapping. <laughs> Aw. You must be hungry, huh? Sorry. But this is people food. <clears throat> Whoa, easy there. I can spare a bite. <laughs> See a guy in a black robe come through? Hmm. Now that you mention it, it was his one hooded fella, with a chocobo carriage headed toward a cave nearby. Though I am a skilled tracker, I have one terrible weakness. What? My appetite. With this overpowering aroma of meat in the air, I don't think I'll be able to focus on the kidnapper's scent. <laughs> I heard that. Grilled meat is all it takes to throw you off your game? <laughs> Cloud, look. They gotta be close. Time to put the doctor's light to use.
Keep it together. Good luck. Here goes. Get ready. Is too much? Huh? Get him! Bingo! Bring it! Gotcha. Oh, no. Moving on then. Warmed up.
So, do we wait? Help! Some crazy bastard kidnapped us and stuck us in this cave! Huh? Why would we know anything? We were too freaked out to even look at him. Kidnapper could be anywhere or anyone. A smell. Cloud, it's them. Shit. Oh, boo! Aren't you a clever little puppy, sniffing out the truth? <sighs> okay, where is he? Think we just tell you? We're not your average criminals, kid. In fact, we're the world's greatest double act. Ellie, the elusive! Bury the brash! <laughs> I wonder what your friends would have paid for you. Guess we'll never know. Too bad. Big 
Or you're next. Ah, oh, shit. Now what? Now? Now nothing. Dog or no dog, they're never gonna be able to find that dude without us. Hear that? Give us the money, or we're gonna. What? <sighs> hey! We told you to stay put! <sighs> I knew we should have tied him up. Oh, <sighs> you what? Old buddy of yours? Barry, look. The kid's eyes. He's a soldier. No wonder he wiped the floor with that monster. But time ain't on his side. Even the strongest ones don't stay strong for long. Sooner or later, he'll wind up like all the rest. Another mumbling hooded freak. <sighs> stay a while! Sure you got lots to catch up on! Suck it, losers! Let him go. We got our man. <sighs> Let's take him back to Sheeran. Glad to see our man still alive. And save for a few scrapes, none the worse for the wear. Is it true that soldiers' cells degrade? Uh, believe me, if I knew, I'd tell you. But Shinra keeps a tight lid on everything soldier-related. Only doctors with access to those secrets are the company's own. I certainly don't qualify. If anyone here was gonna have answers, it'd be you, son. Been feeling under the weather? Not really. The procedure you boys underwent was cutting edge. So much so, I doubt anyone in the company knew what the long-term effects might be. The more information we have, the better. <laughs> so, uh, change your mind about that blood sample? No. <laughs> well, one of these days, I'll win you over. It with that Shinra scientist. Oh, wow, it is you. I'm Fran. And I'm Naomi. Name's Yorda. And we would like to hire you for a job. Interested? That depends. It's simple. Girl and boy go on a date. Easy peasy, right? A date? The three of us are designers for Costa del Sol's premier fashion boutique. For our next line, we're thinking something sexy, perfect for the beach, the bar, or in the boudoir. But creatively speaking, it's been a struggle. We've been racking our brains forever. And the showcase is basically now. It's do or die, and we don't want to kill our careers. 
So, that's where you come in. We want to see a real couple on a date, for inspiration. Well, sound like a good gig? Hojo, as in that Shinra guy? We were just doing the mayor a favor, that's all. And if we're being honest, we figured it couldn't hurt to butter up a company bigwig. We got a business to run. Because we can tell you like your women assertive. And since we're all about strong, confident ladies, we thought, ka-ching! One look at you and we knew. That woman's not afraid to take what she wants. Maybe? I mean, uh, I'd like to think so. We knew you would! And so... We've already planned the perfect date for lovebirds like you. Get rowdy at Run Wild. Be ready to swashbuckle at Pirate's Rampage. This is going to be your best date yet. We'll make sure of it. You're going to absolutely love what we've cooked up for you. First, find Naomi and Fran. They'll kickstart your date. They'll be waiting for you at Run Wild and Pirate's Rampage. Have fun! This is one of the stranger jobs you've accepted. Still a job. I'll take the lead. Hey, I can help. I'll make this date our best yet. We could just keep it simple. And what's a simple date in your world? Like a walk? Across rooftops, perhaps? Sure. Ah, memories. <laughs> Look who it is. So, are you ready to aim and fire? Do well, and you might just land a bullseye on her heart. Sure, I've got better aim. Now here's a woman who knows how to hunt for a man I like. I'm better with a sword. She never once took her eyes off her man, and the way she stared at him, the score didn't matter. Thanks, cuties. That was just what I needed. I'll head back now that the creative juices are flowing again. You two, however, still have a date to finish. Go find Naomi at Run Wild. I wonder what the girls have next on the agenda for us. More cheap date ideas? Oh, what enough. We're trying to enjoy ourselves. I'm trying to get paid. You're no fun at all today. Do they have a well, for the record, I am treating this as a date. I wish you would. Hey, how about an orb or two? The best locally made accessories. I'm no romantic. Believe me, I know. Right. Step right up. We've got the best. Of Welcome to Run Wild, a paradise. For Someone took their sweet time. I see. Better hurry, or the game will start without you. What game? Run Wild, of course. Tell me you've heard of it. It's only the hottest sport in town. Not hard to guess why, seeing all those cutie wooties. I mean, it's the perfect spot for a date. Are you ready to go? All right. Wish me luck, okay? You do know this is for animals, right? Not people? People are technically animals, too, right? So it's cool. Wrong! Not cool. What? I really can't compete? No, but your pet can. Though I take umbrage with that nomenclature, I'm happy to offer my assistance. Brett's got this. <sighs> well, I guess we'll just have to be the cheer squad. Give me an E! Give me a D! You are like...
like a red bolt shooting across that field. I am quick on my feet. The three of us should go around sometime. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> if you enjoy losing. Hmm. Their dog is the glue that binds their relationship. And watching their little guy give it his all out there only served to strengthen their bond. That's it! I'm such a genius! I've got to get this idea down on paper! I need to get back to the shop, like, yesterday! Yorda's at the stables for the final part of your date. So what are you waiting for? Get those tushies on a chocobo! Froggy's fine, but no biting. Wonder what sort of design the girls are gonna come up with. Extra, hey, extra. what kind of swimsuit would you wanna see? Me? Yes, you. I'm curious. Well, I prefer function over form. This so, durable. Maybe made with non absorbent materials that allow for full range of motion. In case you need to fight underwater. <laughs> Okie oh dokie then. Way to make tracks is on Choco Back. Choco Bows for rent right here, folks. There you are. Okay, I've got a great activity for you. So the idea is to ride Kaima here and enjoy a romantic stroll along the beach. Oh. <laughs> but that on its own sounds like a huge yawn fest. So try hunting for shells while you're at it. How about you bring me the largest one you can find? Sound good? I'll be chilling back here. So you two run along and have yourselves one shell of a time. What are you still doing here? Get down to the beach and see what kind of shells you can find. Don't forget to have fun, okay? I don't know the about best you, way to make tracks is on Choco Bag. For me. Choco You've ridden them before. I'm not talking about the Chocobos. Oh. You meant the shells, right? Right. <sighs> Wait a second. Are you nervous? About what? Easiest job I've ever had. We should be able to find some good shells around here. But first, we clean up the trash. All right, seashells. Ready or not, here we come. <sighs> Let's saddle up first, then search. Sounds good. Back on the birds we go. One too. You know, you can hear the ocean if you put the seashell right up against your ear. That's a myth. Oh, just try it, you spoil sport. I'm good. Here. <sighs> cool, cool. <laughs> Keep it down, Bernie.
think I've ever seen a shell this big before. Hmm, if these things are all this size, I bet the suckers who live in them would make for good eating. Wonder how they taste. <laughs> we could ask a local, but you don't strike me as the type to care all that much. I don't. Food's food. Uh-oh. Don't you know what happens to people who say they don't care what their food tastes like? They spontaneously combust. You're screwing with me, right? I guess we'll see, won't we? That should just about do it. Okay, ready to go? Are you sure? Really? Leaving the decision to me? What about you, Cloud? Are you sure? This is the part where you're supposed to blurt out, I don't want to go back. I want to stay here with you. This date's DOA otherwise. Okay, now you're just being mean. I'm not trying to be mean. I... Sorry. So, happen to find any neat shells out there? How is the beach? Romantic? <gasps> Whoa! Huge, right? Dang, that thing belongs in a museum or something. I can't help but wonder what is making her smile from ear to ear like that. Is it the shells? Or... Ha! I've got it! Inspiration has finally struck! I know what to make! But before I go, swing by the fashion showcase. We want you front row center! See you there! Next time we need a chocobo, I say we ride double. And slow down the, the bird? The best way to make Which tracks is on Choco Bag! Chocobo's for rent here. right here, folks! I'm still steering. Oh, fine. If you've got the to be the man of the master. You're not just a master. You're a god of Wanna shoot your shot? This swimsuit's got perfect aim. <laughs> Love might be a game, but you'll never lose in this winning ensemble. Wanna land a big catch? With this look, it'll be hook, line, and sinker. <laughs> My friend. Who among you doesn't ache for that perfect swimsuit physique? You want to get ripped? You want a hot bod? Then you better train with the best of the best! So, so come, come join, join our gym, gym and muscle, muscle maximize! maximize. You were the inspo after all. I absolutely loved it. But the two of us didn't do anything inspo worthy. We just had fun. That's what we wanted. Happy couples get us inspired and fired up. Exactly. This place is more than just a vacay spot. It's a paradise where people come to create lifelong memories. And making sure they do is what we do best. So next time you swing by, promise to frolic in the waters, bask in the sun. Enjoy our town to its fullest and leave with a smile. <laughs> Is that Cloud? Oh, hey! You trade the city for the beach, too? What are you doing here? Relaxing, really. We're on our yearly beach retreat. 
and commissioning this year's new singlets from these talented young women. <laughs> oh, right. That reminds me. Stop by the training facility when you have a moment. We're in need of your particular skills. Okay. you could make it, Cloud, Tifa. Once a year, we take a retreat to enjoy the sun and sea breeze. Nothing like getting some gains in the great outdoors. What do you say? Care to sweat with us? I think I would. I haven't done a proper workout in forever. Well, we'll happily help you both become your best selves. Train with us as long as you like. You mean it? Well, I might just take you up on that. Here's a question for you, Cloud. What would you say is the key to a good workout? <laughs> Fair enough. The heart is the strongest muscle. But I'm not too concerned about that. As you know, our passion for getting pumped up is second to none. Now let's get down to business, shall we? The reason I wanted you to stop by? Monsters have been spotted skulking around the facility, and I want them gone. Sure. Should be easy enough. Splendid. We can't train our bodies unless our minds are at ease. So you'll be doing all of us muscle heads a big favor. And two-second break. Slam that protein! Nothing beats a good protein. Let's get out there and kick some ass. Someone's excited. Well, yeah. Wanted an excuse to work up a sweat, and now I've got one. Wonder what little Tifa would say. <laughs> I think she'd be pretty proud.
Best do it right. Go on! It's on you. You're up. I'll take care of them. You'll see. Sorry, but I gotta. Is that it? You'll see. <laughs> Gotta go for it now. Lend me your strength. Feeling chilly? You've got this. My turn. Get him! Get him! You're dead! Come on! Let's do this. Gotcha. Come on, this one's for you. Can't really go wrong with steak, I guess. What? Huh? Oh, sorry. Just some mental meal prep. The ideal post-workout dish. <laughs> so, you were the one behind Seventh Heaven's menu? Half was a holdover from the old owner. The better half was mine. Uh, should I ate there more? Yeah. You snooze, you lose. Eater. Soldiers can't be choosers. We ate what we were fed. Well, I used to be super picky, actually. Really? Used to be. Not anymore, though. Can't be choosers in the slums, either. What about crap? Mm, not a fan. <laughs> yeah, me neither. Do they feed soldiers? They put a lot of thought into making them healthy. Not much into making them tasty. Ugh. <laughs> that face says it all. You know, it's funny. What? Didn't realize it at the time, but... We ate pretty good when we were kids. Yeah. Homegrown fruits and vegetables. And great chefs eager to use them. Go on! 
Let's be smart. You're mine. This ends here. Don't overdo it. So it's my turn? Get ready. Okay. Get him! Sorry, but I gotta. Don't catch it. You can do it! Let's do this. Let's do this. Time to get serious. Good night. That's the last of them. You ready to head back? Cloud, Tifa, heard you two took care of our little monster problem. Can't thank you enough. Now we can get back to training fiend free. Excuse me. Sorry about it, but you wouldn't happen to be the one who beat these guys in a pull-up contest, would you? Uh. Watch it, rookie. Don't badmouth us. But that's how it went down, right? <laughs> You're Tifa, right? After I heard how you crushed it, I knew I had to join the gym. You're the reason I'm here. Oh, wow. And I'm not your only fan. Look, all of us signed up because we wanted to be just like you. It's just as she says. Thanks to you, our female membership has absolutely skyrocketed. Needless to say, we're very grateful. I didn't really do anything. Are you kidding me? You're literally my inspiration! Which is why I, uh... I want to challenge you to a sit-up contest! Uh, right now? So you know, Amina's been training to achieve your look, Tifa. You'd be helping her measure her progress. Let me sweeten the deal. If your abs prove superior, I'll add a bonus to your reward. How's that sound? Easy on me, okay? Oh. Mm. Where'd that come from? You really are on a whole other level. I was just getting warmed up. <laughs> wow, you've got abs of adamantite. Thanks a lot. You put up a good fight, though. Like I said, you're an inspiration. To me, to all of us. Nobody's born with a beautiful physique like yours. I can tell you poured gallons of blood, sweat, and tears into your training. Honestly, I... <sighs> Sorry. Thank you. Glad I could help. Well, actually, I was hoping that, if it's not too much to ask, would you, Tifa, be my muscle mentor? Me? Really? I don't know. By all means, you have my blessing. If you don't mind dropping by from time to time, I'm sure she'd benefit from your advice. Might as well. If that's what you want. 
Then I'll back you up. Oh my gosh! Thanks, Coach! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Muscle mentor. Has a nice ring to it. Here you go, then. Your extermination fee. And is promised a little extra for helping her out. Come back whenever you want to pump some iron. You're always welcome. If you're in the mood for a challenge today, then I'm your guy. Alright, give it your best shot. Train even harder. Get super swole. All right, you and me. It's go time. Okay, let's get this party started! Ah, uh, no! I was just getting warmed up. Hot damn, girl! That was a whooping I won't forget. 